do something that the world's never done before. Let's hope that it's in, insanely hard to do. Um, the reason why you choose something insanely hard to do, by the way, so that you have lots of time to go learn it. If something is insanely easy to do, like tic-tac-toe, I wouldn't, you know, fuss over it. And the reason for that, obviously, is highly competitive. And so you got to choose something that's incredibly hard to do. And that, that thing that's hard to do discourages a whole bunch of other, all by itself, because the person who's willing to, to, to suffer the longest wins. And so we choose things that are incredibly hard to do. And you've heard me say pain and suffering a lot. And, there, and it's actually a positive attribute. People who can suffer are the, ultimately the ones that are the most successful. Number one. Number two, you should choose something that somehow you're destined to do. Either a set of qualities about your personality or your expertise or the people you're surrounded by, your scale, your, whatever your perspective, whatever you're somehow destined to do. And then number three, you better, you better love working on that thing so much because unless so, the pain and suffering is too great. 